Welcome back to another episode of Best Roblox Games. In today's video, I want to show you a game that I just found out about. It's called Super Golf. And this game is really fun to play with like a group of friends. And if you want to check this game out, I'll put a link for it down in the description. And they do also have free private servers. Okay, that was one of my friends. But basically, to start out on a PC, you left click and then you move your mouse left and right in order to determine how hard you're going to hit the ball. And you can just aim with the mouse. Usually it will show you a line. Yeah, so right now I'm pretty much just trying to aim right at the um, the hole. And you got it's a little bit tricky because you got to get the power just right. But I like the way they do it in this game. Once you get good at it, um, you can usually consistently get close at least. Like there's definitely a lot of skill to this game. So right now I'm using 50% power and I tried to hit that little corner. Whoa, and that was almost perfect. Okay, we got par, which means we got it in in the number of strokes that it was supposed to take. Okay, that time we actually, yeah, we got it in two. So we're winning right now. Okay, this one here is a little bit trickier. This one's got like a sand trap at the bottom. And so when you hit the sand, it will slow down your ball. Ooh, hole in one. Yeah, that's actually decently hard to get in this game. I've only gotten it a couple of times. And once somebody gets in the ball, if you're playing with a team, as soon as somebody gets in, gets their ball in, it puts a timer up where the rest of the players only have one minute to get it in after that point. So it kind of keeps the game going. I kind of like how they do it. Yeah, there I was able to jump and get into this area, but that was a little bit risky. As you can see, one of the other players I'm playing with, their ball like went flying off into the uh, sand. Yeah, and it uses all the golf terms too. I think birdie means you got one less than par. And par means like how many strokes it should take you to get in. So if something says a par of three, then it should take you three tries to get in. I think that's right. Okay, the other two are tied right now. Okay, yeah, this one's a little bit tricky too. This is a par three. There's like a little bridge over there. I think I'm just going to try to get it close to the bridge. That actually worked. I got lucky. There's another sand trap. Yeah, it's just going to take some practice to figure out how much speed you need. I got extremely lucky. Like I said, I think a birdie means one less than par. Eagle means two less than par, I think. Okay, this one we got to do a jump. And another sand trap. Yeah, I always aim for those. You see the little triangle in the corner? If you hit that kind of right in the middle, usually it will shoot you out like it just did. And then you're in decent position to be able to get in on the next one. Yeah, that was too much. Probably 25, something like that would have been better for that. Oh, and they just showed we just got a new personal best for this course. They have, I think, three different courses right now that you can pick from. Yeah, so far we're doing decent. Okay, this is another crazy one. You can kind of zoom out to see the whole course. But the hole's actually like way over there. So I'm going to try to jump this thing and make it straight to the hole. Nope, I messed up. Okay, that time I was trying to jump up to that top part. I thought maybe that'd be easier, but it seems like it's too hard to do that. Yeah, I'm doing pretty bad on this one. I probably should have just tried to do it the normal way without jumping it. 
but I'm pretty much almost out of time. Okay, so now I gave everybody a chance to catch up. Okay, here's another jump one. And it looks like it's a slide after the jump. So you have to jump it into like a slide or something like that. He's got a sand trap too. Yeah, I hit it too hard. I think it ended up jumping the sand trap, so that's why I didn't have to hit it as hard. It's really close for second place. All right, this one's got a spinning bridge. This one looks pretty big. Okay, now I just need to get it close to that bridge so that way I'll be set up for the next shot. But I hit it way too hard. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay, this one, it looks like it's got like a little bridge that goes up and down. I don't know if you can see that back there. Yeah, that time I didn't do it hard enough. And it's a little bit hard to see the arrow when you're on a hill. Okay, this is a par five, so this one's probably pretty hard. Oh no. Yeah, I was trying to get it to go up that hill, but... I'm giving them a chance to catch up on this one. Okay. Yeah, they're already done. And the bad thing on this one is if you hit it too hard, it's going to end up falling back down like it just did. And I've only got like 30 seconds left. I do like how they show you the last power that you used. All right, this one, I'm pretty much not getting in on this one. Yeah, that one shouldn't have been that hard, but for some reason, that one really messed me up. Okay, so now it's a little bit closer. They're 11 away. Two more holes. Yeah, I'm kind of checking out to see what's looks like it's just a big pyramid and it goes around the pyramid. I think the only trick on this one is if you hit it way too hard it may go flying off the side.
Okay, we got a bogey. Yeah, we tied them on that one. Okay, I think this is the final hole. I'm just going to try to get it over there so it's I can make a straight shot on that thing that's pushing the ball out. And that one, you just got to time it right. Now it's got like a big slide. So I just want to get it close to the entrance of the slide. So we got to go down the slide and do a jump at the end, it looks like. Once you get in here, I think, I think you're pretty much guaranteed to get it in, but I'm not 100% sure. Okay, we got it. All right, we were able to win 83 to 101, but it was really close for second. But yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I'll see you guys in the next video.